to a cranky of the history of old time music. And um, uh, several people here have um, were kind enough to pose for some of the scenes. And um, Cecil Gorgain has built this beautiful cranky box out of um, wormy chestnut. So anyway, I'm very grateful that this um, nice team has agreed to, to try this today. The history of old time music. In Ireland and Scotland, there is an old tradition called the Cayley. For hundreds of years, people have gone to neighbors' houses to visit and share stories and music. Sometimes people sang old ballads. All in the merry month of May. immigrated to America. Before they left home, friends and family would gather to say goodbye. Often immigrants would never see their loved ones or homeland again, so they called this last goodbye an American wake. Some people took their fiddles with them. across the Atlantic Ocean was long with crowded conditions. Oh. <laughs> 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 to keep people's spirits up, often dancing to the music of the fiddle. people who were kidnapped in Africa and taken to America to be slaves. Conditions for Africans on those ships was, were miserable. Some remembered the music and dancing of their homeland in Africa. arrived in America, they brought their music. <laughs> Fiddlers kept playing
playing tunes from Great Britain, often giving them new names. The tune King's Head became Soldier's Joy. <laughs> from their home, which was made from a gourd. They grew gourds in America and sometimes used them to make a contings. <laughs> the accounting gradually changed into a new instrument called the banjo. Musicians from Ireland and Africa began to play music together. The melodies of the fiddle blended with the rhythm of the banjo made a, mu made a new musical sound unique to America. <laughs> and other instruments with the banjo and fiddle. Thank you. 
Now the Junior Appalachian Musicians Program is helping to keep old time alive as local musicians across the Blue Ridge teach young people to play and appreciate this music.